Gareth Southgate has emerged as a shock contender to become Manchester United manager as the club become increasingly concerned that Mauricio Pochettino will stay at Tottenham. After parting ways with Jose Mourinho in December, United have seen caretaker boss Ole Gunnar Solskjaer win all five of his games in charge, but they are no closer to appointing a permanent replacement. With Diego Simeon and Zinedine Zidane also in the frame, Sportsmail looks at the five main contenders to take over at Old Trafford this summer. Gareth Southgate Teamland boss Southgate penned a new contract to stay on as manager until after the 2022 World Cup in Qatar following the Three Lions' success in Russia, where they reached the semi-finals. A chance to jump ship may prove difficult following his recent renewal, and the future task of leading a vibrant and youthful England side to another major tournament is one he probably wouldn't turn down. United are also said to be wary of Southgate's lack of experience at club level. Prior to his success at national team level, he has only had one spell at club level, where he managed Middlesbrough for three years between 2006 and 2009. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer most managers would have buckled at the chance to walk into United after the dismal final few months of Mourinho's tenure. Solskjaer, though, has turned things around completely. The morale around the camp is higher than it has been for years, and that is showing on the pitch with five wins from five under the club legend. If things continue in the same manner it would be a tough call to deny Solskjaer the chance to take the reins permanently, but his lack of experience at an elite club could go against him. Mauricio Pochettino following the dismissal of Mourinho before Christmas, Pochettino was deemed the favourite to succeed the Portuguese at Old Trafford. He appeared the natural successor following his incredible work at Tottenham over the past five years, turning them from top four hopefuls to genuine title contenders. The Argentine also has plenty of admirers at the club, and he was even Sir Alex Ferguson's choice for the job back when Mourinho was appointed in 2016. United have already reportedly made moves for him to join at the end of the season, but may have to pay up to £40 million in compensation. He remains the preferred candidate in the eyes of executive vice chairman Ed Woodward, but the task of convincing him away from North London could force the club to look elsewhere. Zinedine Zidane Zidane, who guided Real Madrid to three successive Champions League victories during his tenure, is another strong candidate to take over from Mourinho on a permanent basis. The Frenchman is currently out of work after opting to lead Los Blancos in May after securing his final European trophy against Liverpool in Kiev. He has the stature and proven experience to guide United back to the summit of English football. Critics will point out, though, that there wasn't much work to do when he took over at the Bernabeu, and having Cristiano Ronaldo up front was a major factor in his success.
Reports suggest Zidane has already spoken to the club and they have canvassed his ideas on new players. Diego Simeon Simeon has emerged as a candidate in recent days, but the 48-year-old has 18 months left on his Atletico Madrid contract and is currently in negotiations over an extension. In seven years in charge of Los Rojiblancos, the feisty Argentine has led the club to the La Liga title, two Champions League finals and two Europa League trophies. He has often expressed a desire to leave in the past but remains in place at the Wanda Metropolitano. Simeon's dogged and defensive-minded approach could be his downfall in the race for the job with United Keane to return to the offensive style that won so many trophies before Sir Alex departed.